What's up, you guys? Let's read some energy. And Sisters of the Highest White Light, what is the message? The King of Pentacles in the reverse position. This could be a narcissistic father. This could also be somebody who is in general like... ungrounded. We've also got the justice card, so that's why it leads me to believe that somebody is ungrounded and there might be some sort... I actually saw the magician in the reverse position at the bottom of the deck, so I feel like there might be some trickery or something like that that's going on. What else, spirit? That is making somebody ungrounded. about something to keep someone in a cycle. What else, spirit? Page of Pentacles in the reverse position. It's delaying somebody's abundance. There's too many cards. What else, spirit? We have the chariot in the reverse position and we have the four of swords in the reverse position. This is like, I hate, I hate these, <laughs> what is their karma? But I feel like they're, I literally, when I saw the chariot in the reverse position too, I didn't want to say it, but I feel like somebody might be getting in a car accident. I hate, I, I don't want to be the person that says it, but I'm, what else spirit? Let's just pull some more cards. Page of Cups, somebody might be coming back into your life and it might it might come as a surprise, like a huge surprise, okay? Like this, the page is a messenger. They might be coming in with an emotional message of sorts, okay? You see this fish right here? It's like this fish just kind of like jumped out of this cup and like surprise, it's like, hello, surprise, there's like a, there's a fish in your cup, you know what I mean? So it, it might be, it, it might come as a surprise. I'd like to clarify these four of swords and the chariot in the reverse position. I'd like to clarify the chariot in the reverse position. Somebody's trying to keep somebody in a cycle and somebody is going to get their ass kicked by karma because it's, it's making the scales of karma unbalanced. It's making somebody um, ungrounded so they're not able to, to do what it is that they need to do with regards to their path, which that creates an imbalance in the universe, okay? The world card. This is the end of a cycle. Two of Pentacles in reverse position. Make sure that you're not juggling too much. Somebody is self righteous. Maybe this is somebody who's coming into your life. Maybe this is somebody who you're not expecting to be self righteous, but they are. We've got the Empress card here. I feel like you embody the Empress energy. You're very stable, you're very creative, you're in the flow. You could be Empress, Emperor, you're a boss. You could also be a parent. This could also be a parent who's getting in the way. What else, Spirit? This could be a parent who's lying, creating a smear campaign of sorts that is, um creating some dark energy around you, which is creating um, interference, it is kind of shifting one's reality. Words have power that, um, can shift the fabric of reality, so that's why, you know, you gotta be careful what you say, so if somebody's running their mouth and it's a smear campaign and a bunch of lies, it could be coming out, um, it could be materializing without them even knowing. They don't even know that it's materializing, but that is actually affecting their karma, okay? Queen of Cups in the reverse position. This is this is a bad parent. This is somebody who is emotionally uninvolved, somebody who is emotionally distant, somebody who is um it's like
why are they, I just, I'm sorry, I heard a message, but then my cat just meowed. Um, it's like somebody is, emotionally cold because they're jealous emotionally cold you represent what they wish they could be five of swords in the reverse position this is not going to happen anymore the tower in the reverse position you're going this is not going to be happening anymore Ten of Cups. You're going to have a happy home. If this has created some sort of a separation between you and your person, you and your person will be coming back together. Um, it's like this person just talks and talks and runs their mouth and it has been creating a lot of bad luck. They're shifting. It's, it's gang stalking. I don't know what else to say. Seven of Wands. You have a foot up though. Like, whether you know it or not, you and your ancestors are fighting this, and you will win. Knight of Swords. Somebody might be coming towards you. Eight of Wands. They feel a little stuck in their head. It might actually be this energy that's surrounding you that is actually making them feel stuck in their head, or has been making them feel stuck in their head. There's a lot of ego surrounding whoever this narcissist is. Not your person who's coming in, but surrounding this narcissist who's been smear campaigning. There's a lot of ego. They misjudged your strength, though. And judgment has been passed on them. Karma will be served. Nine of Cups in the reverse position. They will not be getting their wish. Seven of Swords in the reverse position. They will not be able to get away with this anymore. I feel like you're the type of person who usually when you set your mind to something, it materializes. But there's this, there has been this pushback from the universe, from the smear campaign, from whoever this is who is jealous or who doesn't have anything else better to talk about. Either way, that these this has been material. Somebody's bored. Somebody needs to get a fucking something um they're lying about your work maybe too um so i don't know if you've been noticing um like any type of uh sorry i lost that message god they're obsessed okay <sighs> I feel like whoever your person is, your person, whoever your person is, they're coming in and it's almost like on some level the two had to understand. It's like when you and your person come together, the two of you are that much more powerful. Okay, this is the message I'm receiving. It's like when you and your person come together, the two of you are incredibly powerful. But because there was, the reason that the two were separated was essentially to catch this karmic. Because the karmic would never have, how do you say it, like fought against you, so to speak. Okay, tried this if you were connected with your person. Okay, so I feel like it's almost like your person had to separate from you, which was difficult for your person. I think they're even caught in their head about why there was a separation, I think. And because I can, anyways, but it's like there had to be a separation. It's like, it was like, how do you say it? It's like a, um, to catch a thief. I don't know. That's a, that's a thievery corporation album name that's the thing that's coming that's that's what's coming in my mind but it's to catch a thief it's like if if you and your person would have been together at this time um they, they would have never even tried to have like fucked with you because they knew that they wouldn't have been able to get away with it because so in essence your person had to separate from you to trick them so that so that the universe would see what their true intentions are so that judgment could be passed. Smear campaign. To keep you in a low frequency cycle. 
if you have been depressed lately, you, you'll be lifted out of this fog very soon, and you, you are moving towards calmer waters with the Six of Swords here. An awakening with the sun and abundance. Yeah. That is the reading, you guys. I hope that you are all doing really, really amazing. I am sending you guys lots of love. Um, thank you, everyone, too, for all of your donations. I really, really, really appreciate that so much. You guys have no, you have absolutely no idea. Um, if you would like to make a donation to to help support this channel, um, you can do that either through my Cash App or through my PayPal. Um, anything helps. Every little bit counts. Um, I also have an Etsy shop. Um, that it, uh, you know, if you're looking for any crystal supports, or um, you can just help support the channel by making a purchase there as well. I will leave a link to that in the description box below. Um, and for those of you who don't know, many of you already know this, but um, most of the minerals, rocks I I traveled, dug up myself, did all the lapidary work, did all the metal work, all of that stuff. So um, that all really really helps a lot. Okay, if you would like a personal reading as well, um, you can text me six one six four eight five three four seven nine we can set that up and I'm sending you guys lots of love and um, I just hope that you're all doing really well. Thanks so much for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. All right. Thanks so much. Bye.